servo is mounted now and uh, I used uh, a type of glue uh, that is uh, silicone based so it's uh, very flexible and very strong I'm gonna show you how it works on okay here it is now I can choose to turn just a little or full as stock you can only turn full that way or that way so now it's adjustable and in here you can see the servo and it turning okay the other things here now they are uh, still just lying here because I have thought about this battery, it's too heavy and <coughs> I think I want to keep the uh, ESC and the receiver in a little box sealed so no water can get into it maybe uh, get a little box on the side here and uh, I think I will have a smaller battery and that battery I mount the front here. Okay, it's finished, masked up, and ready for paint. Okay, it has got the coat with very dark blue now. Now I'm gonna use 
put a layer with glitter. Uh, see how that turns out. It's painted now and it has changed so this color is a very dark blue color two coats and I did use a sil silver flake uh, glitter color on top so it's very sparkling I think this will look very good in the sun and I did just paint uh, upper side and the lower side is still white I think that looks good like this so I really like this color turned out really good I think The next thing I will do is to mount the ESC and the receiver in a box inside the boat. I have this uh, box here that comes with the boat and it seems to fit perfect with the ESC and the receiver in it so that's what I'm gonna mount in the boat it's perfect and it has seals around here I think that will be very good and I might have to uh, cut around the top here and let this stick out and I'm gonna uh, use silicone around so there will not uh, get any water in it and still the cooling ribs will come out of the box so they won't be sealed in the box I think that might uh, it work very good and uh, the uh, ESC and the receiver uh, will be uh, protected from water and I can sc screw this uh, box into the <coughs> mounts here it's hard to see and it's so dark I can get some more lights okay you can see it better now there's a mount on each side so the box will go down with those, those mounts and I'm gonna have the battery in front so I have uh, ordered uh, uh, two S LiPo battery that I'm gonna go and that I'm going to use and uh, that will sit in front here because this battery is too heavy I think might this is too but I will try to make it fit and I'm gonna have a Tamiya plug here so I will take this off and change this with a, a Tamiya plug instead okay it's all packed in here now and I have made a hole uh, on the side to get all the wiring out so I'm gonna put the top on ok 
okay I have it to the box now so now that all uh, the electronics are inside here and out of this hole all the wires comes out and I'm gonna seal that hole and I'm gonna seal around the um, cooling bars so it will be very tight and I hope no water will come in there's a little hole in the, on the side here too so I'm gonna silicone in that hole too Sealed now with silicone all around and then a gap in the middle too. So I hope this will work and the ESC will be cooled. And I also have around the hole here, all the wires coming out and a little hole as up on here. It's a little hole there. So I'm gonna mount this in the boat in here now it's mounted in the original box in the place original place it's looking good so <coughs> servo is in here that is glued with a silicon based glue so that won't go anywhere and the only thing I need now is a mount for the battery and after that something to cool the motor I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about that yet but uh, I'm gonna figure out something Let's go. 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 Let's go.